So it has come to my attention, there is a new COD community channel that's got all us small YouTubers a little excited this week. And believe it or not, this commentary is not an at Keemstar response video. Yeah, I know, I've seen them all too. Now I will say one thing, Keemstar must have very tender nipples at the minute, because the amount of people suckling on his titties right now is something else. Now okay, this is not a rant video, because I'm past that. This is a heartfelt, passionate commentary. Ah fuck it, this is a shout out video. And before you start commenting, please give me a shout out Higgsy. I have been subscribed forever and I like all your content. No, I don't do shoutouts. But I do like to help people, especially when it's someone that is willing to help us, the YouTube community, in growing our channel or simply just giving us advice in some way. Now I'm going to leave a link in the description to a new COD community channel ran by a few guys that I know through YouTube and in particular one, Quality Darn, who has actually, believe it or not, helped me more than he probably knows since I began this YouTube thing. Now last week when Keemstar uploaded quote unquote that video talking about is the COD community dead? and becoming the fucking modern day Mother Teresa by offering help to small YouTube channels and talked about setting up a community channel and people flocked to him. We were like Syrian refugees finding this beautiful island we could all live happily ever after and we'd have a million subs and Keemstar was our leader, hashtag in Keem we trust, bow down before this mighty cod god. Ah, much has changed in a week. Now I'm not going to get into a rant on how he pretty much won 80 on his promise to save us all and how he sucked us all into a channel that gained 22,000 subs in less than 24 hours and how he is not doing this for money or credit. All profits will go to the community in some form. But I will say I respect a man that keeps his word and that is all I will say. Anyway, as we all know, it can be difficult to grow a channel on YouTube. We could all sub for sub and everyone would be happy. Or we could actually earn our subs from hard work and dedication and perseverance. I much prefer the latter. It feels more honest. Now, I don't know if you remember way back to when I was a silly little naive boy lost in the wilderness that is YouTube. I used to have a little series I did. It was called Upload of the Week. Y you don't remember? No, that's okay. Neither do I. But that was an idea I came up with to give back to the community. A way to show appreciation to the community. Now, I never asked for you to subscribe. I didn't want to be perceived as I was the only one gaining from this. A bit like so many so-called shoutout series as I see in YouTube. But we'll not get into that. Just to break it down, I simply offered you a slot on my channel every Friday to upload whatever the hell you wanted and hopefully you would gain some exposure and to be honest, I'd get to see some new fresh talent and have some fun. And yeah, to be honest, I did. It was good. I think it ran for about five, six weeks, whatever, and people basically stopped sending in clips and I looked like a massive tit. So I went away and sulked and came back and got on with it. But while doing that I did realise how difficult it can be to put yourself out there, to offer help and try not to come across as a hero or I'm only doing this for my benefit. So that's why I respect anyone who has the balls to go out of their way to offer help because it, it is a huge responsibility. Take Thunder for example. Imagine the amount of shit he must sit through before he finds a commentary good enough to upload to TSG. Now I don't mean any disrespect, but put it this way, I, I'm a small YouTuber and while I was doing upload of the week I, I sat through some pretty terrible entries, but I felt the responsibility and I was old enough and mature enough to reply to each and every one. If I thought it wasn't good enough, I'd you know give them some tips or friendly advice. I didn't want to upload it if it wasn't good enough because it was going on my channel and I do respect my subscribers and if I thought something wasn't 
say up to standards, I certainly wouldn't expect my subs to sit and watch it. But while doing Upload of the Week I met a few pretty fucking cool people on that venture and, and felt somewhat good in myself that I helped them out a little. Yes, they may, may have only gained a few subs but I'm, I'm, I made friendships, I think. And, and likewise with TSG, I've been subbed to TSG for quite a long time now and I have met a hell of a lot of decent content creators through them uploading to TSG. Now the concept is obviously very simple but extremely effective. You upload a commentary to an audience and if you're good enough you'll gain a few subs and if you're not, that audience has the balls to tell you in the form of constructive criticism. Now however you deal with that, that is obviously up to you. Now I'm going to dedicate this commentary entirely to the COD community channel and I really do wish you all the best of luck, I really do mean that. And I hate asking my subscribers to do this and do that but please I ask you one thing. Head over to, to these guys, the link in the description and show them the support they need because they cannot do this alone. As a community we need to stand together and support each other because as much as the larger channels always say, we need your help, without you I'd be nothing. It's the small channels that need the help more so and I'm not talking about myself because I'm obviously very grateful for the support I already have and I hate saying it every video because I know certain people say, no thank you, <laughs> but thank you so much. I'm in, I'm in my happy place right now, Higgsy's happy place. So anyway guys, thanks all for watching and I'll see you all in the next video. Love ya. Bye. Oh, I think someone else is actually on the fucking ballistic as well. Yes, yes. Oh, I'm trying to bounce it. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> hey, I was a conquering hero. <laughs> trying to balance it, he says. Oh, me and Higgsy both got, oh, I got ten setbacks. Yeah? Higgsy got nine? I feel sorry for the Queen. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think I, I got her a couple of times.